Some say the secret to healthy living is a lifestyle change, and on Saturday, members of Sweatshop sought to offer consumers and fitness enthusiasts the opportunity to either shop for products or services related to the development of one's well-being or participate in fun activities designed to make you sweat. Director of Sweatshop Sharon Diaz told CNews the event is in its first year and she hopes it will encourage people to take care of their bodies. And it's not about being skinny or anything like that. It's about health and taking proper care of your body and knowing what, how your body works. One fitness instructor at the Duro Body Fitness Center said healthy is all about keeping active. The fact is that we have become quite sedentary as a population and that's a world issue. It's not just Trinidad and Tobago. And uh, as a result, um, any sort of movement that offers the body a bit of intensity that makes it work in a different way and helps it to now develop in a, in a different capacity than, than just sitting down all the time. Anything like that would help. We even ran into celebrity worldwide fitness educator Samantha Clayton. I've been traveling around the world just promoting health, fitness and exercise. Former Olympian, mama four. So I'm here in Trini this weekend to get people motivated, let them know wherever they are in their life, they can just get back in shape, get powerful and just become their best self. So. And if you were looking to take soca music beyond the carnival season, locally created fitness program Soca Fit has just that. Soca Fit is a, a, an entire system developed here in Trinidad and Tobago. It uses exclusively soca music and soca dance moves as a way to, to get fit. And also we've been trying to work on combating non-communicable diseases. The system has different components. So we have ongoing classes, which we can find in Port of Spain, in the East, in South. Uh, we also have community burns, which are free. Persons can just come out and experience it. We've done one in... Um, We've done Point Fourteen. we've done Maruga, actually there's a community boom going on today in Toko. We head across to Tobago next week. Marie Hall, C News.